name is Mandy Bridgman and I'm here with your Mold Fact of the Day. Many of you are aware of the air quality in your own city, but far less of you know what's causing poor air quality in your home. Today we're going to find out what's to blame for poor air quality in your house. There are two different types of contaminants which affect air quality, one being chemical and the other biological. Mold is a biological contaminant. The ideal humidity level in a home is between 30 and 60 percent. So if your moisture levels rise above this amount, you could be inviting the growth of mold into your home. Mold affects your home's air quality, which can in turn affect your health. Poor air quality has been known to cause allergic reactions, asthma, and other respiratory illnesses. Having a specialist test your home for air contaminants is vital to the health of your family. Once the results come back, the specific types of mold found in your home will be identified and the next steps can be taken on treating your home's contamination and improving air quality. One way you can prevent mold-related illness in your home is to install proper ventilation systems. High humidity areas can be found in your basement, kitchen, and in your bathroom. Making sure these areas are well ventilated is key in preventing airborne contaminants. For more information on how to eradicate mold from your home, please visit bustmold.com. And make sure you like us on Facebook at facebook.com backslash bustmold.